How are they better made? <laughs> you want to be better made than chips, than, better made than a car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All your product better made. It'd want to be deadly. I present to you a variety of flavors from Better Made Potato Chips, a Detroit, Michigan based company that has been the favorite chip of Detroiters for generations. I simply wish to give something back to you good folks for the entertaining videos and for the window you provide me to the land and people of my ancestors. Respectfully, Steve Cooper. <laughs> That is the biggest packet of crisps I've ever seen in my life. That's incredible. It's original. Okay, I but love we, original. We start somewhere. I, I'm a big fan of an original I'm just crisp. An anti-original person. 90 years of being better made. I've never heard of you. Yeah. <laughs> in 1934, there were over 20 potato chip companies in Detroit. Today, only better made remains. Oh my God. It's like <laughs> the Armageddon sad, of crisps. Yeah. They're nice. I like them. Do you know what they are? They're real like soft. Yeah, yeah. no, nah. Yeah, big fan. That's a good chip. It's a good chip. Um, they're nicer than Lay's. They remind me a bit of Lay's, but nicer. Agreed, yeah. I would definitely need that whole bag. Like, without a second thought. Yeah, me too. I mean, they taste better made than other chips. See, funny enough, I think that Ireland has the best chips in the world. We, we know a good crisp, like, because we know a good potato. Yes, it's a good chip. Yeah. This is the best. We'll have to see with the next bag. <laughs> like I know the clue is in the name, but they actually do seem like they're well made. Yeah. Yeah. Dare I say. Like a protest. Yeah. Better made. Better made. <laughs> yeah. They're lovely. <laughs> no, they're very, very good. What do we got? Now, I wasn't expecting those to be barbecue. Barbecue. Was they are orange. Family oh. bag. Like, look, it's the size. It's bigger than me head. Like. Sorry, I didn't wait for you again. No, that's they're fine. amazing. That's fine. Very good. Mm. Okay. Yeah. You know what? These taste exactly like Pringles barbecue. That's a good barbecue chip though. Yeah, it is good. That's watching the football game on Monday night. <laughs> oh, a bit of a kick with. Hello. You know the way sometimes it's like um, hickory flavored barbecue? Yeah. This feels real like that, even though I don't think it says it anywhere on it, but. Mm. Oh, I like these. Yeah, they are good. Get into his own. I wouldn't, I'd just be like. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> I wouldn't stop. Oh, Steve. These are amazing. Thank you so, I love them. Absolutely love them. These are the nicest barbecue crisps I've ever had in my life. You put it into my own person, it's kind of sweet from them. There's a smoky aftertaste. Yeah, compared to other barbecue flavored crisps, is this better made than other ones? I have to say it is. Yeah. Well, I thought these guys are overconfident here. They're a bit smug, don't like them. Mm. You proved me wrong. I look like an idiot now. <laughs> I didn't want to say. Yeah. So I was like, man, Martin looks like an idiot right now. <laughs> just because they got the flavor real right. Like, I feel like their flavoring for ready salted was really good. I just personally feel like barbecue is a better flavor in general. So, like, the crisp went up with the flavor. I agree. It's nothing against no shade to the ready salted one, just the barbecues. I just prefer barbecue. Divine. Oh, those are better made. I give you that. Do you know how I think they need to start using crisps? Crunching them up on a sandwich. Mm -hmm. So, if you've got a BLT, before you put that second slice of bread, add a little bit of a crunch. Nearly choked just thinking about it. <laughs> oh, sour, I love sour cream and onion. Oh my God. Beautiful. So we got some sour cream and onion up in here. What do you think? Too? I don't, I'm not gone in it as a flavor. No? No. Like the Pringles sour cream and onion, not a fan. I ate too many as a kid and got sick. So the, so the, you ate too many, got sick. The lesson wasn't, I should eat less crisp, it was, don't like. Yeah. <laughs> it's weird, isn't it, how like green is such a sour cream and onion flavor? It, it, yeah. I, I think it's because of Pringles, right? You know what I find funny about American foods? On all Irish foods, we have this huge writing, no artificial colors and flavors. Yeah. And on all the American foods, <laughs> artificially flavored. <laughs> yeah. These are like, meh, aren't they? They're a bit flowery or something. Yeah. It, just, it reminds me of going over to friend's house or my ma's friend's house when like their child had a, a communion or something and you're just sitting there eating because there's nothing else to do. Oh God, they're so good. Oh, they're gorgeous, amazing. These are super. I mean, I'm still like demolishing them here, but oh, we got a big one. To be fair, I think it's hard to follow the last ones. The last ones are so good. I was for you, Colin. But... <laughs> I was satisfying. This reminds me of something. Go on. Um, these remind, these taste the exact same way as uh, my friend's mom smells. <laughs> these taste the exact same way as my friend's mom. 
How she no, not how she tastes. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes how she smells. It tastes how she smells. She has like a sour cream onion kind of whiff about her. <laughs> like these are equally as good crisps. I think me and Anne just prefer barbecue. Does that make sense? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Like they're so good. Um, but I'd agree the barbecue are slightly better. No, they're not better made now. No. And also, if you're going for a sour cream and onion flavour, you need a crinkle. Yeah, I'd agree with you there. They're actually a sour cream and onion crisp, because I, um, I wouldn't be into them, but they're, uh, they're good. You know why? But, yeah. Because they're better made. Some vinegar! Oh my god, these smell intense. <laughs> they do, actually. <laughs> oh, I need a gas mask for them. Claire, it's your lucky day. Oh, it smells so good. And it's the right colour. Now, salt and vinegar is my favourite flavour of crisp. Mm. So, the bar's up here. And again, good salt and vinegar packaging. I kind of like that metallic blue thing going on. Yeah. Isn't it so weird the way certain flavours of crisp have a colour? Yeah. This is surprising to me because I didn't think Americans had salt and vinegar. They're exactly like Tato salt and vinegar. These are the closest to Irish crisps yeah. we've had. These are sting on the side of my uh, <clears throat> my lips here. Not too vinegary. Yeah. Not too salty either. No. <laughs> Pretty plain. <laughs> Can I ask a personal question? Sure. How did her mouth feel now? Like my mouth feels super wet. Like the walls of my mouth are wet from how good yeah. these crisps are. Salad, yeah. The saliva is dripping. Yeah. I'm flat here. Cause these are flat. I represent my feeling toward the crisps. I didn't know vinegar was <clears throat> big in America either. Mm. I was like, you never hear Americans being like, oh my God, I love vinegar. <laughs> <laughs> what did they say that about though? Like, well, <laughs> I love sour cream and onion. <laughs> they my say. mom smells like it. They really are. Mm. Like, I can't, I know I'm like a broken record, but like I'm really loving these crisps. Like, you know the way scientists design how much flavoring to put in so you want just enough to want the next one. Like, I feel like they nailed it. They nailed it, and by virtue, have nailed us. Like, I can't stop. Hot! Hot barbecue, woo woo! Red hot barbecue. Hot barbecue, hey! Yeah, but like, we loved barbecue so much, it's gonna be hard to like improve on that, you know? Yeah, I mean, the last one's had a bit of a kick, so I wonder yeah. how spicy these ones are gonna be. Flavored artificially. Ah, whew! Thank God. So they don't use real barbecues for these. <laughs> no, no. It's a steel and a wheel. I don't think these taste any different to the other ones. But they're not exactly the same as the other ones. No, they're not too hot. No, not too hot at all. I mean, they're hot. Yeah, you do get a little kick off them. Yeah, it's like you're eating and then it's like, oh, they're spicy for a second. Oh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Yeah. Yeah. They're really good. They are. Um, Man, this is so, these are brilliant. Too. Like, I'm having a great day. They're not hot, hot. No, they're not. They're not hot, hot. No. They're just like, oh, there's a bit of spice there. Have them with a beer, would you? My, uh, Watching the soccer game. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, I love soccer. I feel like these would be really good with beer. I actually preferred the other barbecue ones because they were more consistent. I agree. I agree. They were better made. <laughs> What the what? Rainbow, old fashioned, dark. That's just four different words. That picture, who <laughs> said? That's the picture I want to market my products with. When George Crumb, great name for a crisp maker, invented the Saratoga chip in 1853, he used <clears throat> table stock potatoes, the only potato that was available at that time. The result was often dark chips with a sweet burnt taste as a result of caramelizing of the sugars that occurred during frying. Right. So in other words, every Burnt chip. So these are the out of rejects. The other, out of the other bags, got put in air. These are the reject crisps. Yeah. You know how they look burnt? Like they fully taste exactly like what you think they will. Oh, they really do taste like eating burnt chips. Sounds like they're just justifying their fuck ups here. <laughs> I don't understand why there'd be an appeal for these. Mm. I know what you mean. I'd rather them if they were just mixed in with the other packets. I'm not disgusted, but I'm not in awe. Same. They're in the factory going, who who actually likes burnt crisps? Then an American came in and went, I love burnt crisps. <laughs> I like them. I'm just real glad that they exist and they're not in the bin. Overall, I enjoyed it. I had a good time. Yeah, no, I love <laughs> when I get to eat crisps in here, so I'm fucking happy out. Yeah, I think they are better made. Overall, they lived up to the hype. <laughs> and I mean, it pains them to say it, apparently. Yeah. 
they were the best crisps I've ever had in my entire life. No major complaints. <laughs> no Which is complaints. shocking for us. <laughs> oh my God, you know what I love, Martin? What do you love? I love subscribers. Oh my God, I love subscribing too. I <laughs> Oh my god, I love when they hit that bell and click all! Oh my god, I love reading comments! Oh my god, I love that! We love you, America. We're not, we're only messing. We're sound. Use our sound.